With round three of the Geneva talks on peace in Syria looming, the list of attendees appears far from set in stone. The Syrian government has agreed to participate in Friday's discussions. However, United Nations envoy Staffan de Mistura is waiting on confirmation from Syria's two main opposition groups. Members of the Syrian Democratic Council have begun to arrive in Switzerland, but they say they won't participate unless their allies in the Syrian Kurdish PYD party are invited. The PYD has been excluded at the request of Turkey. However, Russia has since said the group could join talks at a later date. Squabbles aside, Syrian refugees in Jordan say they expect the talks to have little effect on the five-year civil war. This man says as long as there are no terms to remove President Bashar al-Assad's regime completely, the situation in Syria will not be solved. Another added, we've been here for five years. During this time, the first and second Geneva conferences took place, and now the third one. We've seen no results on the ground, no ceasefires, and children and the elderly are still the victims of barrel bombs. No one's able to do anything, not even a ceasefire, nothing happened. <laughs> The High Negotiations Committee, the second main Syrian opposition group, says it will only attend the talks if the UN lifts sieges on blockaded districts and enforces a halt on attacks on civilian areas.